weight warm up, maybe just a body weight squat with your hands in front, and then pair that with a push up. If you're a beginner, you can just do maybe uh, squats up against a wall and kneeling push ups. But whatever you're going to do, do a couple rounds of that, 10 repetitions each, and your body's going to be ready to go for the next exercises. The best two exercises to pair together in a 10 minute turbulence training workout are the dumbbell squat and the dumbbell chest press. Because when you do the dumbbell squat, you're working your lower body, quite obviously, but you're also working your upper back by holding those dumbbells there. So in the first set through, pick a weight that's relatively easy, do 10 repetitions, something that you can do about 15 to 20 repetitions with. So pick a nice easy weight. Same with the dumbbell chest press. After you do 10 of those dumbbell squats, over and do 10 chest presses. The great thing about this pairing is that usually you can use the same weight for the dumbbell squat as you can in the dumbbell chest press. So after you're done that first round of the, of the superset, go immediately into the same exercise, the dumbbell squat, but increase the weight so that now the exercise is a very hard challenge at about eight repetitions. Same thing, do the squat, then do the chest press. If eight repetitions was relatively easy, add more weight and go on and do as much as you can in 10 minutes and that's your workout. And if you do that with a quick warm up and good weights, you pick your right weights, you can get an incredible workout in only 10 minutes, training your entire body from head to toe with the dumbbell squat and dumbbell chest press. And you'll increase your metabolism, burn fat and build muscle.